Thank you, Chairperson. Uh, I just want to find a, a clarity here. In terms of advertising, I just see that the advert will be placed on the print media. I just want to confirm if that is true and why uh, only print media was chosen. Thank you. Thank you very much, Chairperson. Greetings to colleagues, to the support staff, and everyone that is part of this meeting. Um, Chairperson, I do respect all languages that are um, official within our country. I just have a, a question, though, on why do we think it's necessary to have the advert translated to all um, South African official languages, number, number one. Number two, do we have uh, means, uh, considering also that uh, this portfolio is pro-persons uh, with disabilities, that if uh, we have individuals that maybe are um, vision impaired, they'll be able to, to, to have access to this information. If yes, we would like to know how, so that we can also assist in our respective portfolios to, 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 to spread the information. There's a document that was circulated to us. Thank you very much for, for the hard copies. Um, I'm a PPT, so <laughs> I still prefer hard copies. Thank you, thank you. There's a document that was um, circulated to us that indicates um, the criteria that was asked by one of the honorable members, which we truly appreciate. What I would like to find out it is um, if this information or the website is going to be provided to us. And Shepherson, just to go back a little bit on the first question that I had on the issue of translation. When I look at the program that is given to us, the translation is going to take about two weeks. And uh, Honorable Fander Meve and Honorable Spies have indicated that we are going to take a lengthy period to finalize this process. So I wanted to check if it's, it's possible. Maybe I need to know what motivated for the translation into all official languages, number one. Number two, if it's possible to just keep the adverts in English so that we can try maybe and minimize our time. I think that will shorten our time looking at the whole SEM process that we need to undergo to finalize the, trans the translation. Thank you very much. Can I, can I request, because it's not, members must lift up their hand when we say terms for clarity. We can't every, after somebody has spoken, we lift up our hand, hand it's going to take us back. And it also, it also dislodges us a little bit as people that are concentrating on. Honorable Adonis, you are the last hand. For now. Uh, 
Thank you so much, Chairperson, and good morning or good afternoon to fellow colleagues, honourable members and support staff and yourself as Chairperson. Apologies for coming in late with raising my hand. Um, I do agree with Honourable Kainile on understanding um, what is the strategy in terms of making sure that the advert and the dissemination of information is accessible for all young people in South Africa so that we make sure that this advert reaches each and every single person. I mean, if we're speaking about translating it in the various South African languages, have we taken into consideration sign language and braille printing if we're saying it's going to be printed? Number two, um, what is the plan on working with organizations to disseminate this information and whether this process will allow for organizations to make um, organizational submissions of the preferred candidates to be shortlisted. Lastly, um, and I think this was said by Comrade um, Spies, if I'm correct, uh, to say that in terms of the uh, panel, how will the panel be constituted? And I think the chairperson, you said you would then respond to how we're going to constitute uh, the panel that will be going through the interview uh, process. Uh, lastly, it's to look at um, ways in which this is going to be communicated beyond just the print media. And perhaps we can also be given guidance as to what would the appropriate response be and communication when we go into our constituency, seeing that we are currently in constituency period, so that we do not find ourselves giving conflicting uh, views on this particular matter, or maybe perhaps um, committing the portfolio committee to, to something that we have not agreed on. And I think it's very important for us to sort of have a brief as to what must be communicated if we are approached by community members or any form of media houses, so that it is in line with the direction of the portfolio committee, but also through the instruction of uh, the uh, chairperson of the portfolio committee. Thank you, Chair. Can I, can I just start with the letter? We, as you will be in our constituents' office, we're in a constituents' period, and obviously everybody now is aware that we are seated here. Here is a, an administrative process. We, we are asking questions on an administrative process. So when we are out there, the question, if we are asked, I'll make an example. You, you, you chaired a meeting. What was the view of the meeting? And I'm making an example. My response was, we were briefed by the committee section on an administrative process. And that means, it means how then are we going to move forward in terms of time frames and whatever. So, that's where we are. I'm making an example about myself. That's what I will. That's how I will respond to my, to my, to my constituents. Two, the other issues will be uh, responded by the content advice. We have got nine official languages, of which it's ten now in terms of the. The, the deaf way, yes, sign languages. Remember in the last committee we said we must avoid opening ourselves up for litigation. And therefore, it is our responsibility that we avoid by all means to open up ourselves, to open a parliament through ourselves on litigation, on using one official language. I, I think Ms. Novatana did say that they are going to do, go through procurement processes. They know how is that being done by parliament, but it has never, it can be one official language language uh, that we are to advertise. Two, we are not in a, it is a bill where public comments are requested. If we if we're, we'll be dealing with a bill, the committee section will, will, will put
put up an advert. The department, in fact, will start by putting up an advert for people to comment. Uh, the cabinet has circulated a particular bill. Comments are there either verbal or written. Then it then comes to the committee. The committee also follow its own processes through the committee section of putting up an advert for comments or individual presentations in a bill. So I hope, I hope members are going to be able to see the, the difference. We are now dealing with a board, a board which is our responsibility. And this board then, how then the board is then constituted is how it has been explained. We don't invite outside people to come and tell us whom they want to appoint. We follow those processes. It will be, I'm making an example, the 20th to the 3rd, that period we say civil society comments on shortlisted candidates. The civil society is given a a space, if Linda Ratujwa is in the list, they say, no, we have got a problem. Linda Ratujwa is 50 years old. i make an example. So th that is how this process, so we're not going to call civil society to come in and say we want this one, we don't want this one. The third one is we are the panel. We are to conduct interviews, we are to shortlist. So it's our baby. We are not going to be. So that's why it was important when the Ms. Abrams said, that's why it is very, very important that if you start, you don't break. We, st we have started all of us here. So we must start and finish. The reason is that if you start and you, 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 you pull out in the middle and at a particular time you had an interest that I wanted a, a Fisani Shabangu and you decided to come back, you are going to create a, 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 a stumbling block for us. We, we, we wouldn't like that. So we, that is why therefore I want to make this proposal because what Honorable uh, uh, Fana Melve is raising and some of the, is that this time frame, I've also picked that up, but I have got a responsibility to go and talk with powers to be because we, 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 we will be, they can, we will then be allowed to rework to, 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 to fit that is why, therefore, it is going to be important today. Welcome to LT Celeb Times. That's it for now, guys. And uh, please tell us what you think about this on the comment section below. And thank you so much for watching.